Hello, welcome to Fun with Julian Engineering. From our previous videos, we already know that all reservoirs usually have a low vertical height and a wide horizontal extent compared to the vertical height. Therefore, most times we drill horizontal holes like this, so we can reach and stay as long as possible in the oil and gas reservoir. For example, the borehole looks like this little wire model in my hand. Along the course of the drilling process, the inclination and the direction are constantly changing. And if we want to monitor the well path during the drilling, we have to determine the inclination and the direction at regular intervals. This is why we have measuring instruments on the rig to help us do that. For example, we have a plumb, as you can see here. And with this plumb, we can always measure the inclination of the borehole. In the same vein, with a compass, like this, the normal compass, we can determine in what direction we are drilling. However, today all these measuring devices are already designed and built as electronic components and so you cannot really see how they work. In the past, we had some measuring devices like this where you could actually see the compass, even the plumb beneath the compass. If you look closely, you can see it. So, as I said earlier, today everything is electronic and installed into a device which you call the Measurement While Drilling System, MWD system. We attach it somewhere close to the drill bit at the bottom of the drill string. And with that, we take measurements at regular intervals. At the surface, we apply some mathematical formulae to make calculations to approximate the drilling well path. I will display it at the top view or the side view for the directional driller. This is very useful for the directional driller who is responsible for leading the well to the given target. If we want to know more, come to our lecture on drilling engineering one. We will be happy to see you in Freiburg. Look off.